Hi, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2, episode 28. Thank you so much for a thousand subs. Mom and I are just so overwhelmed yes. and yeah. it, it's just crazy. So thank you guys so much. Um, and yeah. Okay, so what happened last time was the most heartbreaking thing imaginable. Arthur Morgan passed away. And can I just say, I was really shocked that that was the last mission. I, I really wasn't expecting it. I don't know what, what I thought was going to happen, but yeah. I don't know. I thought we had more time with Arthur. Um, and so then we fast forward a couple of years, and now we're following John and his family. And you can still kind of tell that John is still kind of living the, the like, gang lifestyle, I guess. Like, he's still doing everything he was when he was in the gang because they're having to move around a lot. Um, and now John just got a job at a ranch. So we're going to have to see where the game takes us. Hey, hi, John. All right, let's go look at our house. Jeez, can you get your freaking lantern out or something? It's so dark in here. It is. Binoculars. Where's your freaking lantern? You don't have a lantern? Oh, John. <laughs> Silly John. Okay, let's see. Ooh, Siggies. Let's see what we get. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, inspect card, please. Oh, how pretty! A little that parrot. Is pretty. Guarma. No, not Guarma. Sorry, Tahiti. Got anything in our chest? I can't even open it. This is nice. Wait, what's that? Oh, good. There's like a little curtain so that you know John and Abigail can have privacy from oh, John. Nice. I mean, from Jack. Yes. Okay, give me the canned fruit, please. Thank you very much. I wonder what that, there's like blood all over that cutting board. Oh, I oh, guess from meat, duh. Oh yeah. Gosh, it's we got a nice there. little cabin. We're really set up. Oh, shaving kit, let's see. Sorry, I'm not gonna lie. I was like expecting Arthur, even though, and <laughs> that shocked me yeah, a little I'll bit. Yeah, um, Okay. So, what do you think? How do you want his hair to be, Mom? Let's see. You're doing the beard right now. Yes. Let me see. Can I do, like, oh, all facial hair? Here we go. I wish he had a clean shave. What do you mean? I think that is the clean shave. I know, but it's still a day grown out. I know, and I feel like... Honestly, I feel like the bigger beard looks better on him. On him, it does. Yeah. He's like, what the fuck's... Oh! Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God! <gasps> oh, I think I just gave him that haircut on accident. Oh, God, I hope not. Okay, good. He has a hat on, so you can't even tell. That's crazy. Because so it looks good on your... the sides. Yeah, the clipper cut looks good. Yeah, so we'll just act like that's what he looks like. Okay. All right, let's check out our new horse. You got a, you got a lot to live up to. Are you a girl or a... <gasps> Her name's Rachel! Aw, that's sweet. That Let me is. study Rachel. Thoroughbred. Okay, let's give you a little brush. That's so does, better, girl. Does everyone get this horse, I wonder? I wonder, too. You know, or is it, like, random? Let me give a little pat. Hang in there, girl. Hang in there, girl. Mm. We, got, we got cows back here? Yep. Oh, I'm not seeing Somewhere. Them. Yeah, they were pretty loud mooing. Is there a barn? Oh, maybe this way. Yeah, over here. God, you guys are so loud. What the hell? Can I come over and talk to you guys? Oh, wait. These are not cows. These are... What are the male version of cows called? Bulls. These are bulls. Are you guys going to attack me? Hi. Oh, I can't even pet you. You're so cute. You want to let you pet him? No. Oh, I thought they were coming after me. Okay, Jesus Christ. <gasps> what the fuck? What the fuck's going on? Mm. 
Oh, I really upset the gals. Okay. My bad. Let's see this guy. Who are you? Morning. Easy. Oh, or I mean, John. Can you tell me what's going on here? I don't even want to know. Wow. Okay. Kentucky Saddler. Oh, that's a pretty horse right there. What kind of horse are you? Oh, a Tennessee Walker. I do love my Tennessee Walkers. Oh, I love your coat, too. Okay, uh-uh. <laughs> Did you just see the poop flying out of their butt? No, I didn't. It's the first time I haven't seen it. Morning. Hey. Okay, good job. You're okay, mister. Uh-huh. Yeah, that was weird. Okay. See, this is the life Arthur deserved. Yes, it is. Not that John doesn't deserve it, obviously. But it's a big farm, and this is where we came in, right? Yeah. Oh, this is actually where I have to go, so I guess let's do it. I think I've pretty much explored the whole farm. Well, let's go into the main house. Let's see if we can go poke around in there. Oh, cool. There you go. See, Art, uh, John has a much more, like, less goofy run than Arthur did. Pat. Poor Arthur, still making fun of him. Sorry, he had a goofy little run. Hi. Oh, you're so sweet. Here, boy. Aww. Australian Strapherd. Cute. Yeah. Ooh, can I take that? Because I'm going to. I can't even take it. Nice try. A girl can try. Can't even break into the house. You kidding me? Just run around and I quick and see. Okay, side entrance. <laughs> like, who the hell's banging on our door? Repeatedly. Man, they got doors all over. Mm-hmm. Well. Nice try. A girl can try. That's all she can do. That's all. All right, I guess let's go say hi to this guy. Walk in normal. No, no. Oh. no Milton, no. get over here. Okay. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. Yes. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, <gasps> Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. Wow. You and Mr. Dickens. Nice job, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Oh. <laughs> Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Okay. Say, is that your family getting in the Morning, wagon up there? I uh, hope so. Believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. He's hey, a yes. Is it true what they said about you when you arrived? What? Th that you ran off those hired guns? Yep. Look, can we uh not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no. You sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Oh, God, he took off the hat. Oh, yeah, that's not John. Sorry. Hi, this is Milton. Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kind of... 
fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Oh, Real God. wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. You yes. didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. What? I got us a nice little house. Why are you mad at me? Jack has gotten big. Yeah, he has. I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought you was, uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Oh. Where are you from anyway, partner? Around, you know. Up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything. The ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. See, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Absolutely uh, not. Just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Here's the cows. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. <laughs> Looks like you know how to do it to me. Yep. Oh, you ain't so bad. Almost got a pail full. I'm really good at this. No doubt. Hey, Pop. Is that your boy? Sure. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your paw yet. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Come on. He's like, okay, don't you I don't need to get too excited. Boy, uh, yeah. Help me clean out the stables. Sure. Come on, son. He didn't even close the fence. How can you get out? You now, Lancelot. Twelve, sir. Ain't that grand? It's such a fine name. I like it. I got, I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> I can tell. Now it ain't pleasant work, but it's got to be done. Mr. Dickens said. I know what he said. We'll do it, won't we, boy? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. All, All right. right. Okay. Well, I've got Jack, experience with this. Remember? Try yes. and take some pride in this work. Absolutely. Hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, first one. Hold on. You hold on, Jack. Remember when Arthur did this? That's what I was just saying. Oh, that's what you meant. Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. Oh, he said you're a long way off. Ew. Ew. Look out. What? Stinky.
thinking piles of... Be careful. Shut up, Jack. What do you mean, be careful? Coming. Jack looks very disappointed in this He dad. does. It's lucky his dad ain't making him do it. Yeah, I know, really. Your mother's hiding somewhere, laughing at us. <laughs> okay, good talk, Jack. Reckon even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Okay. Lancelot. Lancelot. Abigail, don't be mad at me. I wonder what her name is. Um, Did I'm actually it? not sure. I don't think I've said it. Yeah. Hello, Abigail. Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. I kind of like the buzz cut on him, I'm not going to lie. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. Yeah, it does. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. Me too. Abigail's like, did you, like, mess with the pomade, honey? <laughs> <laughs> While I was gone? <laughs> no pillows? Nope. They didn't have pillows I back in the day? I guess on. not. I'm sure they did. They just didn't have them. <laughs> John's about to fall off that bed. Oh, beautiful. I want to have a little cabin like this. Yeah, it'd be nice. On the lake. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. So, we can... Oh, okay. Okay, so we have a few things. Okay. We need to go to Strawberry. Where is Strawberry? We need to go to Strawberry. Why, you may ask? I do ask. Because someone told me that we can rob the guy that... Remember when we walked in that store and those guys were acting a little suspicious? Like they didn't want us to walk behind the counter? Yeah. Um, well, someone told me that they have, like, a underground business and that we oh, can go rob it. Okay. So, we can do that. We also need to go see Albert Mason. So, let's go do, let's go to, okay. What do you want to do? No, you wanna, you're not going to listen. No, no, no. I'm going to ask. I really am going to listen. Do you want to go see Albert Mason or Strawberry first? We're going to do both. Definitely Strawberry. Okay. That's not where you to pick, is it? Yeah, it is. Is it? Yes. Yeah. I was hoping you weren't going to say Albert Mason first. <laughs> okay. That being said. Okay. If we find a better horse. I mean, this is a beautiful horse, though. But, you know. It's no midnight. It's no midnight. No one will ever replace midnight. No. Oh. Hey. Jack was cuter when he was a little kid. Yeah, he was. He's kind of, like, turning into, like, a little moody... Oh, moody guy yes. now. Those teenage years. How old do you think he is? Ten, maybe? God, I'd say older with his attitude. Ten years old is still sweet. Well, I don't know. No. It's been three years, right? I don't know how many years it's been. I just thought it said a few years later. Oh, it did say that. So at least three, yeah. Yeah. Get away! Oh, 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 oh my god. Anyone? Whoa. Oh, god. Fucking shit, motherfucker. Oh. I don't have a gun. Oh, I'll, I'll try to stab it with a knife. Help! Oh, God, get this thing off me! He looked back. He's like, did you really just stab me? <laughs> you okay? Uh, get health care. Oh, Jesus, please. I can't, I can't. Got some medicine. Better oh, he's nothing. gonna die. Damn it, that won't help. Look at me. I'm bleeding out. Okay, well. <laughs> Oh. What? Oh my god. I thought they wanted me to kill him. 
<laughs> I thought that was what I was supposed to do, and I don't have a gun right now. <laughs> okay, thank you for the snake oil. Ooh, good old possum pelt! Yay! Where did my health care go that he threw on the ground? Is it just gone? Mm-hmm. Looks jerk. like it. I stabbed him in the butthole, I think. I know you did. You're terrible. Come on, honey. Get back over here, Rachel. Rachel's scared of you now. She's like, oh my god. Stay away from my butt. Inspect fur. What? What are you talking about? I Where's wonder. fur? What are you doing? Mm, where? <gasps> Legendary Not buck? Near here. But I don't have a gun. <laughs> what? Where did come you on, just lady. come from? Things are weird right now. I need a gun. Okay, let's go. You sound tired already. That was just stressful. That was stressful. Stabbing yeah. a wolf and then the guy gets mad at me. And then you kill him. And then I kill them. Because I remember literally the first time I was playing, I think, with Arthur. How to make what an aggressive way to say good morning, <laughs> sir! Um, but when I was playing as Arthur, I gave a guy whiskey and he ended up dying anyway, and I felt really bad. But I guess it doesn't matter. I guess they die either way. Yeah. Let's see what's going on at this camp. Especially when you stab them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Let's go check it out. I never have good luck with campfires. Okay. Easy now. You ain't welcome here, so move on. Okay. You get sorry. your ass out of here. Okay, I'm leaving. Okay, okay. Ain't you serious? I thought it was a free country was all. Well. Turns out it's not. Turns out. Okay, this horse is not loving me. God! Back to strawberry. Let's focus, y'all. Ooh, dead animal right here. Let's see if it's fresh. Beautiful lake, wow. Yeah, it is pretty. This is my dinner, don't even look at it. Uh, pick up. Come on, Rachel, hold my, hold my, um, rabbit, please. Yeah, first. Let, maybe we'll go to the. Oh, actually. Whoa. Whoa. Well, that's a nice mount you got there. Why don't you just get off your horse so we can take the market? Oh, hey. Oh, they're gonna chase me! Come on, honey. It's okay. You got this. You got this. Don't get scared. Don't get scared. You got this. Ooh, there's something going on up here. There's a question. Okay, come on. Let's go, let's go. Shit, there's a bear! Settle down, okay? <sighs> I'm scared. Keep going, you're doing it. God damn it. Fucking Go, honey! Rachel! Oh god, Rachel, don't die! Come on, let's go to strawberry. If we go to strawberry, maybe the police can help us. Oh, the Lorene gang. I gotta get a gun so I can deal with those guys. Yeah, you do. Ooh, we made it out. Okay, you're all right, girl. You'll be okay. How will we get again? By going to the store? Yes. Hopefully, we will rob. Oh, I don't. Hmm, I don't have any money. Huh, this is interesting. Very interesting. Hey, we're here. Good ride. Yes, right away. You. Appreciate that. I need to go back and find what that question mark was. I wonder if I can go back to say hi to Charlotte to tell her that Arthur's dead. Oh, that's a good idea. You know what I mean, Joe? Yeah. Green? Can I sell, sell stuff to you, sir? Why, $14. Play, oh no. Play gut fillets? I don't even know what that means. Oh, maybe. Come on, honey. Let's go find, um. Come on, then. Don't sass your horse. Okay. For rent. Whoa, 
now. Shut up. The guy no, can't no. even freaking, you know, ride through town anymore. Do something wrong. Welcome to our fair city. Citizens, enjoy yourselves. Visitors, amuse yourselves. We are a simple mountain town for people who believe in a better, wiser, kinder America. <laughs> okay. Howdy. Good day, kind sir. Hello. Enjoy our fair town in peace and be nice. Be nice. <laughs> okay, I will. Fine hall there. Okay. Welcome to Strawberry, my friends. Okie dokie. What are we doing? Is this the place that has the underground? Sorry. Um, okay, so we need to apparently peep through a window. Let's Thanks, go find Martin. a window to peep through. Wardrobe? What? Why is it saying wardrobe? Yeah. To change it's unavailable. Oh, right at the ranch. Partner. So, you got the time, partner? Don't know. Sorry. Oh, it's okay. Peep through this window? No. Oh, no, we peek through in. the other one. We can see in the other one. Well, but there's like a specific window I need to look through Run. so that I. Oh, maybe under here. Yeah, that's probably it. Mm hmm. What do you got going on in there, mister? Well, well, well. What have we found here? Okay, so I think I need a gun before I can plan on robbing anyone. Yes. So, do you guys have a mail place here? Post office. Thank you very much, Mother. You're welcome. Ooh, there's a butcher down the road, though, and I need to sell some stuff, so. Did you see a post office on there? Hey, no, we're going to have to go find one. Hey there, Hello. Brian. How can I help you? Okay, I got some stuff to sell you. What do you think of that? Oh, that's interesting. I still have the gator eggs that Arthur had. That's funny. Wow. What am I my rabbit? Wow, you've only got $39, John. I know, it's bad. Where's my horse? Hey, honey, come here. I need that rabbit. I didn't mean to hit you, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, can I have the rabbit? You're being a little greedy right now. Okay, let me pull her this way. There! Hey! There! She's like, You're okay. very kind. Okay, here you go. Like, well, how, how much can I get for this rabbit I found on the side of the road? This ticket's got a poor pill. It's just the whole rabbit. I get a dollar. Dollar oh. forty for it. Dollar forty. He's look at him shaking his head. I know. Oh, I'm sorry. He's like, I got bunnies hanging already. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, what's this? There's something going on over here. Can you help me find her? Probably. Please? Yes. Sure. I'll keep an eye out. She's a foxhound. You know, white and brown. I if you find her, I live in a house on the edge of town. Thank you, mister. Okay. Want to search the town? Wow. Jesus Christ. You're a good girl now. How big? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, what, is wow. it telling me it's on the other side? Okay. Well, I hope that's where it is. 
Put the lean. I have a feeling that film will prove more profitable than you. You got some kind of problem? Oh my god, no, besides you trying to kill my horse. Pet it. Aww. Okay, I got Anyone it. seen a uh, cat? Excuse me. A dog. A dog? Yeah. Sorry, yeah. I think it's in the you don't give me space, you'll be sorry. I know, I'm sorry about that. That was too much. Oh, oh, it's over here. Jeez Louise, come on. Damn, lots of rocks. Uh-huh. I'm coming, I'm coming, little dog. Hi, honey! Let's go and treat some. Come here, girl. What's wrong? Come on. You miss your daddy. Yeah, yeah good girl. Give her a pat. Come on. All right, little feller. Aww. So sweet. Come on, we gotta go. We gotta go back to your dad. How's he gonna get him following? I think the dog's just gonna follow me. Come on! Yeah, come on. You, mister! Good morning. Keep it coming, honey. Strawberry's got a lot going on, huh? Yeah, it does. Busy little town. Yes. Mister, you better give me some money for this dog. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm all up in your business. <clears throat> Can I go loot his house while he's so doing this? So good to see you, girl. <laughs> You're so bad. Oh, I can't. Damn it. Okay, fine. Thank you, thank you, Mister. We ain't never spent a night apart. She's the closest thing to a family I got left. I'm glad I could help. You take care of her now. Well, not gonna lie. Being nice. <laughs> I, I was expecting a little Moolah. financial compensation, but th you know what? You shouldn't do things because you expect stuff. That's right. You know that was a good lesson for me. It was. You're a good feeling. Okay, honey. Your family go hungry. Okay. Not the point. <laughs> Who cares about that? Yeah. Okay. So let's see. Um, I guess it doesn't really matter which way I go. So we'll go to Riggs Station to go get my mail. And then... The yeah. lottery ticket. Yeah, we need it. Hopefully I'll have some money in there, though. Remember? Because, um, Arthur just finished that book, the dime novel book, no. right before he passed away. So I find it hard to believe John didn't have a gun all these years. I know. He used to have one. Oh yeah, he definitely did. Back in the day. Back in the day. Yeah, I think Art, honestly, I kind of feel like John looks better with short hair. Don't you? Yeah, he does. Oh wait, I have to remember that this horse can take me out. I missed, I missed it. Didn't work, okay. Hmm. Midnight couldn't kick you off? Um, well, well, I think I, if you have, like, a stronger bonding or something like that, uh -huh. then they won't kick you off as much or something like that. Okay. I don't know. Hello. Welcome. How do you do? Receive mail, please. I don't know who that is. Theodore Levin. Is that the... Oh, look at all the money I got. Okay, cool. $50. Okay, let's read it. Mr. Kilgore, I very much doubt you read the li literary pages, but the story of Boy Calloway's final adventures has been quite a sensation. The Wild West may have been tamed, but the appetite for tales of it has not. The book, of course, is terrible. Utter tripe. A sesharine? Yes. Agography? Of a horrible man. All but this it's talk about the wonders of the 1900s. 
Okay. Don't seem too different to me so far. Okay. Um, it's selling like hotcakes. And the best thing about writing about saints is that they are dead. Thank the good Lord. A wise man much once told me the joy of gunslinging was that it is win-win. You get freedom or glory. Callaway can have the freedom. I'll take the glory. You can have the satisfaction of knowing the truth behind a famous lie. Or maybe Callaway has the glory and I have nice the freedom. Nice to see some new faces through here. I hate when they start talking when I'm reading. <laughs> um... Either way, he's dead. Thank you again, good lord. And half of the proceeds of this non uh, nonsense decimation is, are yours. Which is so funny because John has no idea what he's talking about. Right. Okay, great. Now we got some shimani. See you later. Bye. Are you going to get a gun and strawberry? Uh, no, I don't think they have a gun store. I'm going to have to oh, go. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm going to have to find is? a gun store. Wow. There we go. Yeah, I'm so. Shocked. Me too. Like you don't seem shocked. I'm very shocked. What are. John keeps a journal? I guess everybody does. That's weird. Um, okay. Um, oh, he. He has John. Arthur's journal. Wow, that's okay. weird. Huh. Um, being back in the country made me dig up Arthur's old journal again. Odd few years wandering. Now back here, this country that we ran to when things went crazy all those years ago. My mind is full of ghosts. Been a tough few years. <gasps> Jack don't like me and Abigail cannot stand me. Or is it the reverse? Damn. Damn, John. Killed a fella because he looked at me funny. Abigail wants me to settle down. To what? Everything I've tried has gone wrong for so long now, and now I'm back in old country. Well, I guess the north didn't turn out so good. Wonder if there's anything in these treasure maps. Oh, you know what? I never did do any of those treasure maps. No, you didn't. So now I'm a farmhand until I lose my temper again, I guess. Working at a place called Pronghorn Lanch. They seem to like me because I'm big and nasty and they surely ain't. Some local tough guys seem to know they ain't. Well, I guess Abigail, Abigail can't have everything, but she won't be able to deny I've got a normal job. He's full of himself. Who, John? Yes. Yeah. I'm really Howdy, mister. Mister? Okay, now let's go see a man, Albert Mason. Maybe there's a gun <clears throat> store there. What'd you say? Maybe there's a gun store there. Yeah, um, I think that we should be in the area of like maybe Valentine or kind of ish close to it. Uh, so we can always go there. Right. And then that, that way we can get a little good haircut girl. too. All right, so is John going to be a good or a bad man? I don't know. I'm thinking bad. I kind of think so, too. Yeah. Because you think it's so bad already. Yeah. I wonder if John even has good... No, he does have good and bad karma. Because um, when I killed that guy in the butthole, he got mad, so... He got mad or he got bad karma? Or he got bad karma, sorry. <laughs> like yeah. He got mad. I don't think he has the capability to get mad anymore. RIP. I think he's upset with you. I don't care what the story is, lady. You're going in. Prisoner in hand. Keep back from the wagon. I can't Please. save you. Get me out of this damn I don't have a gun! He's a bad man, but I was no part of it. No. I feel bad for him. What line. can we do? Please, just don't take me in. <laughs> I'll break your wow. jaw. Should we mind our business or should we go try to help her with well, our knife? How can we help mm. with our knife? I guess you could try with the knife. You got it out? Yeah. You can be tough. He's after her. Shoot him. <gasps> Damn. Our John. Come on. Go, go, go. You better keep at it. Wow. How quickly you turned off sad little lady act. That was silly of them to jump off the wagon. I know. Have mercy. 
mercy on me. I am. I'm literally trying to save Please you. Look in here. Please. Please help. Just you calling for help. Oh, I don't have a gun please, though. It's please, 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 please break the lock. I'm gonna try to, lady. Give me a freaking minute. I am begging you, please break me. Ma'am. Oh god. Oh god. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to free you. Oh, wow. Let me go. Let me I'm go. trying. Give me a minute. Shit. Don't you move. Really? I can't believe you've this done this to me. Just to hold him high before I pitch a fit. Enough of you. <gasps> Jesus Christ. And I can't even save her. So I did this all for nothing. Oh, yep. That little Michael Jack squad. God. I need a gun. Yeah, you do. Okay. So. I always fall for the sad ladies. I know are, you do. That I, I just believe them. I'm like, oh my god. Damn it, I just turned lost on you. 20 of my dollars. You, wait, she didn't turn on me. She's being kind of like, not oh yeah, she, yeah, that's true. She was like, she's like, all right, get me out of here. I'm like, okay. What I'm trying to do. All right, time to mind our business. I've heard that before. You know. Okay, here we are. <laughs> Mr. Mason. Hello. You think he's gonna be sad? Arthur's dead. Yeah. I think you will. I think everybody will be. Well, not Micah. Yeah, not, Micah. not Dutch. Yeah, not Dutch. No, not Dutch for sure. You. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Can I help you? I think I might be able to help you. My name's John Marston. I heard about your work through an old friend of mine, Arthur Morgan. He passed some time ago. Ah, oh, yes, of course I remember. Arthur, fine fellow. What a shame. Wow. Well, that is very kind of you, Mr. Marston. A little assistance here would certainly be appreciated. I've been here before. Have you? Yeah. He could have had more of a reaction. Yeah. Huh. Oh, I remember Arthur. Huh. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> Fine fella. Wow. Albert Mason. Funny how things turn out. Ain't never how you expect, is it? No, I don't suppose it is. What you shooting? Eagles. You know, the images, they really are beautiful. All thanks to Arthur. I'd be some poor creature's bad meal by now many times over if it weren't for him. Yeah, so I believe, but move back from the cliff edge. I'm trying to get an eagle there, there. They're beautiful, but unlike you, they can fly. <laughs> Too true. You really must think I'm a buffoon, don't you? You think I'm such a dimwit, I'd just slip off the edge of a cliff. No, but, well, maybe a little. Please, sir. I'm dense. Oh, my God! This area is quite safe. Quite, quite. Oh, oh! <gasps> Uh, damn! You're right. I am that much of a buffoon. Give me a hand, please. Put me out of the way. Come here. Oh my uh, god, he's lucky there was a branch to grab. Uh, yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, 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 thank you. Uh, you know what? Bugger the eagles, I'm going home. Uh, you know. I really did get some, some amazing pictures, mostly thanks to Arthur. And somehow, I haven't quite broken my neck. You take care. And you too, sir. Sorry for all the trouble. Oh. Hmm, I wonder how that would have ended with, uh, like if Arthur was there. That was a really quick quest, I'm yeah, sure. Yeah, it was. Okay, well. Come on, honey. Okay, Missy. Missy? Aw, something new. It's a girl. Girl. Um, okay. We don't need to talk shit about no, girl. No, we don't. No. It's okay. been a girl on both mm. horses. Because it works, Mom. I guess it does. It works. Okay, gunsmith, here we come. Ooh, I have mail. I just checked my mail. Oh, no, that's my bounty. I think that if you have a bounty, it's a piece of... Oh, my God. Oh, they're herding some sheep. 
You look at him. I can't believe that. I'm really shocked that was the end of the Albert Mason missions, I guess. No. Ooh, that bunny almost died. Almost bit the dust. Yes, she did. So I wonder who got all Arthur's money. I wonder if you could go find where Arthur died. And just see a skeleton up there? Is well, that what you're looking for? No, his money is what I'm looking for. Okay. But I assume John got it if he has his journal. He didn't know. He's only got 300 something now. He just got 350. Maybe he spent it all though. You oh, know, because it has true. been a couple of years. That's true. Someone gonna help us <gasps> out. Somebody, oh, please. MG Mickey. Hi. Hey, Mister. Hey, wow, brother. he looks different. Hey there, mister. Hey there. Mind if I join you? Mind if I... If I talk to you? Fellas sometimes mind, and sometimes they don't mind, and... Ain't no way of knowing. I don't mind. Oh. I like you. You're kind. I like kindness. I ain't so kind. Now, that ain't true. Ain't true at all. Most folk won't spare me the time of day. But you did. You did. And it was real nice. Real nice. Can I... Can I hold you, mister? We're not gonna Whoa. make the mistake again of um, saying no. <laughs> I got a woman. Ah, oh, I'm sorry, mister. I didn't mean nothing by it. I just kinda like folk, but... Most folk don't like me. Arthur uh, liked you. No harm done. Ain't ever harmful to be held, mister. Only, most folk find me creepy and, and strange. Uh, which ain't nice. I uh, guess not. What's your name? John. Or, uh, Jim. You don't know? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I used to know a fella, a bit like you, a few years back, crazy kind of fella, but he had a heart on him. What was his name? <gasps> I forget. Funny face, Alan, or something, I think. Mickey, are you kidding me? He didn't like me much neither. What? But he was okay. I think he died. They always do. The good ones. He weren't a good one. He was, well, he was good and bad, and it's hard to say quite what he was in the end. <laughs> that's so. Sure. That's so. I can kind of see that. Well, it's been fun talking, mister. My name's Mickey. Um, John's on my shit list for saying that about Arthur. Are you kidding me, motherfucker? Arthur fucking literally died so that you and your family could live. Yeah. Also, why am I almost dead? Have you eaten lately? No, I, I don't think. I don't know, but I just don't know when I almost died. I can't, I can't believe John said that. I know. That's weird. Be with you momentarily. Wow. Ready for a clean slate? Yes. May I help you? Goodbye. See you later. And I can't believe Mickey said Arthur didn't like him. Arthur was always so nice to him. Except Some for people the... will talk about you when you die. I know. Gosh, apparently. A little sprint through town in honor of my man Arthur. Yes. Here we go. I got thick skin, but damn it, this place. I know. I don't need to cheat. You too dumb for that. Nice one. So, you deserve it, or were you cheating like he said? There. Yes, that's my answer. I'm in here for you, sir. Okay, fine, I'll leave. <gasps> Thank you. Ten? I'm not gonna loot him, even though I want to. At this point, you <clears> probably <throat> should be in him. I know, but then the cops are going to be after me, and you know, I don't want to deal with all that. You know? I do know. 
Okay, so, gun store first or... Let's go to the gun store first. Yeah. Thanks for giving me an option. Fine. Gun store first or haircut first? Definitely gun. Okay. We need that. That's what I thought, lady. New patron. Welcome. Well, it's really the catalog you want to look at. It's got everything in here. Well, may I then, please? Oh! Because oh, wow. I work at... Ponghorn Ranch. So we came all the way here. That's weird. For no daggum reason. How are we gonna live without a gun? I guess we better stay at the ranch. Yeah. Okay, let's go get a haircut though. Can you imagine? Haircuts are unavailable while you work at yeah. Long Pond Long Ranch. Ranch. No, it's probably unavailable since you got a buzz already. Is that a drug? Don't be rude to me. <laughs> Had to be said. What am I doing? Fellas? See y'all right. okay? Wow. You have a fine time. That's the only thing you're responding to. Uh, hello there, sir. Hi. Don't think I've seen Howdy, you around mister. here before. Hello there, mister. Thank you. So, Cut hair. What are we doing? Extinction. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally. Okay, Art, I mean, John's handsome. Not as cute as Arthur was. Okay, no. But I like the scars. Can't complain. Arthur's a beautiful man. Yeah. Okay, can we take out the pomade? Ooh! Oh, his hair looks nice like that. And it's wow. still clipper on the sides. I like it. Ooh! Wow. No way. Hey, we're looking. Okay. Well, I guess we are. We're looking, lady. Oh my gosh, no way, Jose. <laughs> He's snarling at it. He didn't like it either, yeah. Okay, the buzz looks good on him, but I think that... Honestly, that first one looks so good. Or no, this one, right? Yeah. Oh, looking good, John. What the heck? My Paul never did a better job himself, I reckon. Okay. Facial hair. Now let's just take a look-see. Full styles. Oh, that's the clean shaving. You, you like that? Yeah, I do. Really? So we can only have two? I'm just looking at everything. I just want to see the different styles they have. Ooh, I like him with a little thin mustache like that. I love his scars. They're so cool. John is handsome. I don't like him naked though, but we'll do it for you. Okay. But the next time I get to choose. Okay. Fine fair job enough. Like this is a walk-in advertisement. He looks like a DQ model. Woo! To be bushy tomorrow. Let's see. Look at right it, John. What the heck? Okay, take the hat off. Take the hat off, John. Oh, I can't take my hat off. Okay, I guess we're not taking the hat off. I'll make sure I'm not here cut off. I don't know. Hello, you handsome oh. man. Hello, you handsome man. Time. Where's my horse? Okay. My horse is out of whistling range. Where the hell is she? Wow. What? Oh, she's over there. Okay, okay. I'll just run over there. Okay, so mom. Do you want to go talk to David Geddes? I can't remember his name. That's, um, David Geddes is, uh, the guy who owns the little ranch. Or Tom Dickens, which is the guy that we met the first day we got here. And then, yeah. Oh, the guy we met when we first got there. Okay, so let me mark that. All right. Let me just sprint to the other side of town. That's all, to the other side of town. Hey, try going around people. Sorry, sorry, didn't mean to scare you. What'd you say, Mom? I said, um, just a little sprint around town, that's all. Yeah, exactly. How big is this town? Pretty big. Pretty, 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 pretty big. Okay. Excuse me, dog. Well, I guess we just need to freaking mind our business until we leave, until we get back, uh, until we get done with Pronghorn Ranch. I guess so. Because we can't do enough. I can't believe you can't have a gun because you work on the ranch. I know. 
It just blows me away, like, how are you supposed to do anything? I agree. I guess it's because we're supposed to be farmhands right now, and that's it. Oh, wait, is this the house? I think it is. Mm. The house. All right, y'all. Oh, look. How nice is that? I wish I had friends like you. <laughs> you guys want to talk? They're like, no. Really? I mean that. You know, life's a strange thing, but all in all, okay. Well, that's good. You be well now. Goodbye now. That was short and sweet. I know, they wouldn't even... It's so funny how these people won't respond to, like, most of the things I say. I know. <gasps> Ow. God, I'm sorry. Are you okay? Damn. These people are probably like, what an Come on, idiot. man. How much has he been drinking? Honey, are you all right? You better give her a treat. Um, Mom, we're poor right now. We cannot afford to give oh, treats. Oh, we don't have all those treats, do we? I don't think so. Let me see. What do we have for her? We have an apple, and no offense, we cannot afford to give her an apple right now. Aw, uh, bless her heart. Rachel's fine. Oh, is she? Yes. She's got a bunch of bruises, I bet. Under her fur, which hey. we can't. Oh, I really need your help, Fran. Again. I know. Listen, I know what this looks like, but uh, you've got to help me out again. And come on, please. I don't have a way to help you, honestly. Again? Oh, fell. Just shoot the damn chains already. I don't have a gun! I'm gonna try to... Just shoot the chains off, please. Damn. I'm done. <gasps> Jesus! Did you do that? I was trying to like see if maybe I could cut the chains. Wow, so you cut him instead. God, I stabbed him twice. At well, least he, I didn't get bad karma for he it. He left you alone after that. Also, but why does he keep getting arrested? That's true. Okay, let's see what's going on over here. Because we helped him. We haven't helped him as John. Oh, that, I was going to say, I didn't like that because I don't think John's ever helped him. Arthur right. did. Arthur did. You see any welcome sign around here? Go on with you. Get out of my sight. Okay, there. Okay, there. We're weaklings without a gun. I know. On. I just have to keep listening to these people who are mean to me. Just moving on. Yes. Oh. Nothing. Just a bunch of little turtles. That was weird, but what the hell? Someone in here? I'm fixing to find out. Oh, oh no. A nice empty house. Ah, this is so cool. I love going in empty houses. We both do. Yes, we do. We haven't done it in a long time, though. Yeah, we have. Because now they're on you about it. Yes. They have cameras now. Um, okay. Out of the way! Yeah, uh. you a traveler? Well, we ain't from around here neither. We're from there. We got a runner. Come on. Wow. Holy fucking We're shit. Fine. Anyway. Hey, um. Okay, good. There you go. And now I do need to feed her an apple. Easy. I think she got shot. She's about that about time. I'm gonna park my work right yeah. here. Got nothing done today. Oh, what the fuck? Saved happened? a man, I guess that was it. Oh yeah. Oh. God, I'm sweaty. What the hell? I'm gonna ask where you been. That's not. I didn't do anything. What? My lord. What did I do? Let me tell him. What have I done to deserve this? <laughs> I don't understand that. What just happened? Oh, these bitches are laying down right now. Is it maybe because, is it maybe like if I come home too late? 
Probably. I wonder if that's it. That's funny. Wow. What did you say, Mom, about the horses? Oh, uh, they were laying down. <laughs> they got up. That oh. was cool to see them laying down. Mm-hmm. All right, mister. Let's talk. Hey, Milton, can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Nope. Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? Mind your business. I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. <laughs> I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. Ooh. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. You make it look so easy. Yep. There's plenty more to do. So get to it. John, take your hat off. There. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now uh, grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and kay. place it in. It's a little higher than the other one. Now, lift up the other side. I gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. How about you give me a damn minute? That's it. You're doing all right. Thanks. Now do the rest of this yourself. <laughs> okay. How funny is this? That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's okay. more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. You think Arthur would have liked doing work like this? No. Really? Arthur had to be on the go, I think. I feel like he would have. You think so? I don't know. I think so. I think Arthur couldn't be settled down. I don't... Oh, okay. One second. I'll be right there. Put that fence down and get over here, boy. Oh, my God. What? Okay, John. Hurry. Hurry. What? What? Come on, son. Milton, get over here. Come on, Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls? No. Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus no is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on. I knew that was coming. Wow. Oh. Shit. I'll get him. Get a rope on him, Neil. No, he's fence. knocking my freaking fence down. Bad ball. Fucking motherfucker. Just walk it off, okay? Yeah. Now where are you going? Ease up. Oh, stop! Oh my god! Oh, damn it. No! You quit it! Oh my no. god! Quit breaking the fence! I gotta build that! Easy now. Oh my god. Crap. This is tough stuff. It is! Okay. 
He's like, what are you doing? Come on! Let's talk. You're an angry one. How am I gonna calm this thing down? You don't look like you're gonna wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. There, there. There, there. Stop. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. Whoa, there. Whoa, there. Easy. Easy. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of Chuck. This way. Oh. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. You guys weren't even helping? <laughs> Party. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. Oh, good. Just your head. Good. Yeah, that's all. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. I love that John got kicked three times. No, one time and then drug around. Yes. A couple times and no one was asking if he's okay. He got hit by a one time. Yeah, he did. Hey. Ooh. I'll get the coffee on. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. I'm cleaning at the doctor's office. Bye. 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 <laughs> Get the place tidy. He's getting. Uh huh. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. So I think the only thing we have available is to go talk to Mr. Gettys. Let's just go see. Let's just make sure that's all. Yep, that's all we can do. I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to full, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. Mm. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Where's the oh, son? over here. Um, I'm good. Oh, I gotta follow Abe. You get on. Go find them horses. Ooh. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't too much... I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck! Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all, hmm? I maybe know, I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. <laughs> so, uh... Is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Well, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Mm. Oh. Uh, okay then. All right. He'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get to. Thanks, kid. I think he's older than you, John. Is he? I don't know. The guy looked older. Oh, God. This kid. You Duncan? God, he's tiny. I'm Jim. He's a Jim Milton. Boy. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. <laughs> That's Jeremiah. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. 
Hey, now. Easy. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? <laughs> Calm down. He likes you. Ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. <laughs> That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. There's a boy. Let me ride him a bit first. Get some of the spunk out of him. Okay. I'll wait in the corral. Tire out. Oh, Easy so now. Upset. Okay. Okay, I thought we were getting somewhere. Turns yeah, out we didn't get easy. anywhere. Chill out. Hey, easy now. I knew a horse like this once. Down, yes, I'm sure you okay. did. His name was Buell. Sorry. Yep. I remember him well. Easy. Mm -hmm. easy now. You're okay. You're okay. 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 Easy. Easy. Easy now. We're fine, ain't we? We're okay. It's all right, ain't it? Okay. Are you okay now? Good horse. Good boy. Get his stamina. Everything you got. Come on. Oh, okay, I guess we shouldn't do this in town. In the in the ranch. You got some energy? Show me there. He's showing you. Uh-huh. Come on. Could this be your new Let horse? Uh I don't think so. Maybe. I don't know. Where's that big mean horse? He's like, stop being mean to me. Okay. That was fun, wasn't it? You can behave now, can't you? Give me some more. Where are you, Duncan? Oh lord. Hey. Here you go, Duncan. Are you mad that I just did that to your horse? Alright. He's ready for yes, you. See, he is. Okay. He almost died. Get on up there and go nice and slow. He's got a concussion, but he's okay. <laughs> He'll be fine. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. The heart's beating a little. <laughs> Keep your <laughs> voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. I won't. Do it fine. His voice is so, nice. like, scared. Yeah, it is. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh. Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich. Way richer than Pa. And he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie. And if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but, but. Just worry about the horse, yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now, both of you. He's 
prancing now. <laughs> Showing off. Mm -hmm. You Mr. Milton? Yeah. I thought you were gonna help me. Who are you? I am. The wife. I was here. Was. Okay. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my husband. Thanks, Jim. You're doing fine, kid. Game, Give him man. a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. What's going on? In here. So, you know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Oh. Not too much. My God. Where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town. And it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Whatever you say, man. I'm nervous. Never delivered a baby before. Nope. No, I got it. Oh, I lost it. Get a hold of it again. Don't crow. It's a sound. Didn't come. It's coming out one way or another. Grab them again. And pull. Oh, it slipped. Find them, Milton. <laughs> come on. Hold. There. Oh, there. Okay, well, I think she's... Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, we, we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm, uh -oh. I'm busy. Uh, t too busy for social calls. Of course. Good day. Miss Giddies was yeah. trying to... <gasps> Miss Giddies was trying to giddy so Oh, dun 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 Oh, John, you almost got in trouble. That's the door. Hello, mister. Show some pride in how you look, dang it. I just got a shave, dude. <laughs> what is wrong with him? Fuck you, motherfucker. Okay, let's go. Hey, John. Jim! <sighs> Sorry. So... This is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on, please. For me. For him. How's he been? He's right there, guys. Can't go outside. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. And do what? Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. He's like, I'm Come good. On. Round to the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Fine. Can we go home? What? You no. What? You're in the yard. <laughs> Stay calm. <laughs> Where would you like to go riding, aside from home? I don't know, but maybe that stream. Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on, you know. The 
horse can feel your fear. Just act confident, okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a... Should I tell him to go faster or slower? Faster. See, you can do it. How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa. May get bucked off the horse. Okay, well now I'm nervous. All you can do is be there, Dad. Yep. It'll be good for him to get bucked off the horse. You know? You gotta yeah. learn. That's right. You're so mean. You think he's going the good speed? I do. Can you get faster? I mean, he can. Yeah, you want him to? I think he's going to get speed. He's oh, faster. Come on. Faster. Okay, faster? well, I just told him faster because I just thought you wow. wanted me to. Well, good. Faster? God, wow. Jack's become a pro all of a sudden. <laughs> I guess I figured that since I was like focusing on Jack, it would like auto yeah. go for me. You know auto about this. Nope. Oh my god. Really? We do. Okay. Let's go across to the stream. Careful. You careful. Yes, sir. Sorry! Oh, I think it's because I'm focused on him. I was like, I don't know what's happening. I forgot I had it held down. Sorry. Look at Easy. that deer. Aww. Yeah, what is it, a deer? Oh, it's a three star. Three star, what? Was that a deer as big as a doe? Really? I think Here we so. Are. An American yep. doe? I think so. We yeah. should get back. You think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right, we go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay, on my go. Go! Huh? I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna let him win. Yeah, you should. Build his confidence. Yes, up. exactly. Oh my God, you're so fast. <laughs> what? We're doing it, boy! Oh, oh, tease. You know how old my horse is. Okay, no response. Uh, Jack is going pretty straight, fall. unlike you. A big fall. What did he say? Jack is going pretty straight, unlike yourself. I know, literally, he's better than me. Already. Just saying. I'm right behind you. I'm gonna get in front of him a little bit. I got the hang of this, sir. And then I'm Don't look like him. it. And then I'm gonna tease him. Oh, I can't. Oh, I can't tease him if I'm in front. Okay. You won't be in front for long. Are you still back there? <gasps> okay, Jack! It feels like I'm flying! Aww. Watch out. Last straight. Come on. Hey up! Don't get cocky, boy. It'd be funny if I beat him at the last second. Yes. Oh, nice. I have to go back for that. Mm -hmm. I beat you! I beat you! I <laughs> well beat... ridden, son. <sighs> I beat you. All right, let's not like get too cocky. You're riding. It's gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Your guns? I did. I don't have a fucking gun. I have a knife. You hear that? 
<laughs> you want to watch your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How oh, fancy pants get. He's paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, yeah, you're not freaking fighting? What's up? Bitch, bitch, bitch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You ain't so big when you don't have a gun. Ooh, oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. Don't do that. Oh, he's licking you, boss. When was the last time you had a bath? Uh, I don't know. Get him! That boy can't. Oh, get, get off that man! Get off! He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? What? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. You're married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll yeah, be you're back. talking real big when you got your fucking ass beat. Listen and shoot. Thank yeah. you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. What? Plenty. Um. What was I supposed to do? Let that guy get harassed? They were shooting at his feet. Why did that just open? I know. I guess it was showing the breeze. You all get caught There's eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. We're hearing Dutch in our ear. Uh-oh. Okay. Old habits. They die hard, Mom. Dear, they do. I, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear Ooh. any of it. Not in front of the man. You toad. All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Ruh -roh. Okay, so let's see what we got, Mama. We can, oh, we can do a quest with Abigail or with um, the guy who owns this place. Um, let's do Abigail. Okay, I was thinking the same see thing. See if she's still ungrateful. Abigail, here we go. Please stop being mad at me. Ooh, I'm getting some stamina from running like this. Yeah, you are. Where the hell are you, Abigail? Oh, why is it having me go the long way around? That's weird. Here. I thought I just heard How are you oh. getting on? Never mind. Maybe she's surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. Only thing I know how to do is. Well, you know, undertakers like me. Cattle? Not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was, I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. What was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom, 
you act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Oh, no. Just feels hopeless. You're doing better. Milton. Okay. Mil my oh. Milton. Okay, my thoughts on this conversation. I feel bad because, like, I see where Abigail's coming. It would be nice to just live a normal life. But then yeah. at the same time, I don't know how it worked back in these days, but I feel like you could just say, oh, yeah, I'm Jimmy Milton, you know, and, yeah. then, and then get a bank loan. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I could be wrong. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Ma'am, Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lancelot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I Ooh. think it's in your name. My name. I think so. One's in your name and the other's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> Okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mind. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. He needs we'll save to learn. The real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. Come on, get. You take I'd like to drive it. Of course. Yeah, you wanna drive a wagon? Oh yeah, I mean in real life, but. Wait, you giving me... the horse a rest? Okay, here you go. It's nice getting So out remember, of the just house, press huh? that and then click X Which to go fast. And then follow this. Okay. I like being in the house, Pa. I think just about doing things you like, boy. Okay, and then yes, you gotta sir. turn. You make that clear enough. What's that supposed to mean? Only that you aren't so happy here with us. Son, I'm happy. I gotta reverse. It's just. I'm not really sure how to reverse. I, I find it. Hard. There we go. Okay, uh, you it's click all. this button. Okay. You'll understand someday. We're stuck. Okay. This is awful. Okay, Lancelot, shut the hell up. I'm gonna find every horse thing I can. Okay, I can walk through the hook. Yeah. Every tree. used to drive this slow. I'm having a hard time getting on the road. Yeah. It's okay. Once you get on the road, you'll be good. Here you go. You're on. You, that's the road right there. We're gonna get it better than this. You got it. You haven't played in a while, so. No, I haven't. It's getting rusty. Very rusty. Oh, good. So we're deciding to go fast. Oh, oh my god. Okay. I gotta remember how sensitive this remote is. Yeah. It's vibrating. Okay. You got this. Remember, you can pretty much. You can pretty much just go, um, just hold it straight, and then it'll... That's what I just started trying. Oh, okay, good. And then just barely move it, yeah. I'm going slow doing it. I'm doing good. I mean, you can go a little faster, but... Here. Want to take the reins a little? John doesn't trust you. No, he doesn't. Uh, it's easy, boy. Don't be scared. Well, uh, well what do I do? Doing well, good, Mama. Just want to strength. Mm hmm. Oh, I'm short to slow down. You can look down right Tell here. Tell him to go faster. No, I just Give him a little switch. And then hold to one side if you want to turn. Here. Try it out. Okay. Okay, I'm not driving now. You done? That was short and sweet. Well, on the way back, if it lets us drive, you can drive. Okay. You can keep playing if you want. No, go ahead. Mine will take forever. Mm -hmm. I've seen you without a book in your hand. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. I'll leave you with the wagon. 
Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, I think I can be trusted to that. Very good. Oh, this is sweet. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, turn hard. Oh my god, Jesus Christ. We ever gonna get to Strawberry going like this? God, no, 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 no. There you go. Can you make a sharp turn? I don't know. We're about to do a three-point turn. No. Still need. Shit. No one better be back here. Okay, we're good. There we go. Okay. Tear the bridge down, but we're good. <laughs> and we're here. Oh, there is a post office in Strawberry. Huh, okay, do you think, I think someone from all the gang right. is going to be are. here because oh. he put something in his name, you know? You all right, son? That'd be cool. Sure. Well, cheer up a little. You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. I gotta get a and drift. if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Okay. Hi, I'm here to- Name? Okay. My name? Um... Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Uh, maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Shut up, mother. Marston. Nope. Nothing here for that name either. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Can you not say it over and over? Christ Almighty. Yes. Here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes. Uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. <clears throat> I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Uh, it's uh, mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. This guy. Okay. This guy's real suspicious right here. Yeah. Everything okay, Pa? No. Sure. I hope so, at least. Okay, let's go. Fast, fast, here. fast, fast. You take the reins a little. Oh, okay, we're letting you sure. back to it. Okay. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Yeah. We're going back to Pronghorn, okay? So, wait. We've come all the way out here, and we're just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh... I miss the seclusion of the ranch more than I figured for. Don't you want to go to the store or the saloon or anywhere? We're going back. Okay, boy? But I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving and watch the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. Jesus. I'm your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. Better. Bad, I don't have a gun. Nope. Look, if, you want. if I tell you to speed up, speed up. If I say slow down, you slow down, okay? Uh, sure. Speed up or slow down? Speed up. Yeah. All right, speed up. Let's get away from there. Okay. Hey ya. Hey ya. I think this is a good speed. It is. Still safe. Mm -hmm. Who's this? Oh, Sorry, this sir. Person. Was that a question for me? No. No, keep driving. Speed up. Just a bit faster now. Mm. 
other person over there. Let's speed this up. Okay, maybe. Well, I don't like driving across here. It's the same as any other road. Look where you want to go, and the horse will follow. Okay. I think the horse is getting skittish. You'll be all right. Stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Here, now! Uh, come on! Quick, down! Okay, son, you wait here. I'll just jump you don't move and I'll say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen. Let's see what you come oh. calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are you John Marson? You sure look like him. What of it? Come here, partner. We don't mean no trouble. Truth is, I killed John Marston. And I'm happy to kill you, too. You're talking bullshit, mister! Kill him! You want to drive the wagon? Oh dear, those men! I told you not to look, boy. Are they dead? No, I don't have much of a choice. You saw okay, that. you're gonna take a left here. Okay. Compose yourself. You killed them, Pa. Son. <gasps> he I was gonna. Oh my God! Dead. I cannot even. This is slow. Careful, Shresher. Okay, now get on this road. back there. Real brave. Did exactly like I said. Really? Uh-huh. Okay, remember? I can't just try. Well, I was gonna say, you're turning too it's hard, so just slowly turn friend. instead. There, there. Why are you going so slow? Because I'm learning to drive, boy. <laughs> Alright, and then you're gonna take a slight right here. Very slight. Oh, shit. Okay, now go back left a little bit. You're, okay, remember not to overcorrect too much. You're gonna get me straight. No, you get yourself straight. <laughs> there you go. Okay. You always gotta take shortcuts. I don't think this is a shortcut. I don't song. either. <laughs> I'm just trying to get back on the road. Can we get home quicker, please? <laughs> you are okay. stressing yourself. Okay. Here we go. Okay, there we go. Alright, alright. I'm just trying there to get where I can do yeah. straight. No, I know. Okay, now you're good. Now you go straight. We're okay. Hey, uh, you know, your mama wants us to buy some old ranch. You read to her about it, didn't you? Mm-hmm. What was it called? Mm-hmm. Well, what was the name, boy? Beecher's Home. That's right. Beecher's Home. Over by Blackwater. You like the idea of that, huh? Us on the ranch. Ah! Ah! I don't know. I can see you as a rancher's boy. 
Like Duncan Geddes, huh? I wasn't so sure, but <laughs> yeah. I think I'm going the wrong way. No, you're, you're, you're okay. Emma. Just get back on the road. The Click that button I showed like you this. to get to back up. You know how to get there? Wouldn't be such a chore if the horses we were cleaning up after was ours, would it? <laughs> no, it wouldn't. Mm. Now I'm definitely going the wrong way. Yeah, you're going backwards, but that's okay. Just keep I'm turning the wagon until. Okay. Alright, you should be able to turn hard to the left. Let's make you end going forward that way. I don't think it's this way. Whoa now. This is nice, isn't it? It is nice. Okay, turn your camera so you can see. Okay. Hey, hey, easy. Oh, wow. Don't stop. Going. Okay, re you, because you're stuck on a tree, so you gotta back up still. Oh. Okay, now try hard, hard left. Okay, now go straight. This is real peaceful, Pa. Okay. Now we're here. Now we're going, y'all. I love all the pretty blue flowers. I'm glad you have time to look at them. I'm going so slow. <laughs> I'm going to count every one of them. Oh, why are we going this way? No. No flower looking for you. I guess not. <laughs> Alright, I think I've done my part. You're done? Yes. <laughs> I thought I could drop the monkey. <laughs> You're doing good then! I was going so slow I had to. Oh, I think we're home. So you pretty much drove us all the way home. Oh, good. Yeah. All I all saw right. was okay. that yellow line going forever. Oh. That was in... Uh... Trip. Don't tell your mother. Go say hi to your mother. Tell her a thing that happened. Yeah. Technically, that wasn't my fault. How was the? No, it wasn't. What happened? Yeah. It's. I don't. We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed, and then... We... Followed by who? Probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. You told me to go Our out. son. I... Okay. Your dress that caused all the problem. It weren't even a dress. It was a gift for you. Ooh. Okay, but you, why would you tell me you put it under John Marston? Right. Like, what? That's or true. Why, why would you put it under Abigail Roberts? Look, just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. That's all. Hmm. Nice memory. It was. My man Arthur. Oh, Arthur. Okay, let's see. Come on, open up me up. Alright, y'all. Say goodbye to John. Let me do this angle so you oh, can see. Oh, so he doesn't go him. to bed like the other one did? Well, I don't know, because it seems to like just start the day for me, you know? Okay. Let's do let's zoom out a little bit so we can get a nice little look at John. Okay. See you later, John. Also, I think he's looking good with his hair. The yeah. facial hair, the haircut, I like it. Yeah, I do too. Alrighty. Okay, so what was your favorite part? Um, I like when we helped with the bull. Okay. And um, there's another part I like. The um, helping the kid with the horse? Yes, I love that. I thought that was yeah. fun too. Yeah, yeah. I like that kid. It was cute like seeing him like get up, try to deal with that big yes. horse and stuff. Honestly, I'm really enjoying just the calm life of... Living on a ranch. Yeah. Even though 
Oh, I, I liked whenever John got to beat up that guy. I forgot about yes. that part. That was fun. And um, But can I just say, I'm really shocked that Abigail's getting so mad at us. I know. I'm like, I don't think we're doing anything. She any- all the time. I know. I'm like, I feel like we're not doing anything wrong. I know. But maybe we are, and I don't know. Um, How did we end up with a gun when we couldn't have one at first? Um, I don't know. It was on the wagon. Oh, So okay. I guess, like, we don't actually have one. It was just, like, on the wagon. Okay. I don't know. Okay. But um, I know. I thought that was funny that we did all that work to go get a right. gun, and then it's like, like you cannot own a gun while you're right. for pronghorn. <laughs> but um but yeah, okay, so for today's question, who do you like playing as better, John or Arthur? Cuz I know that most people who are watching this um they've played Red Dead Redemption 1, so I know that some people have like a connection to John obviously. I am enjoying playing as John, but of course, you know, we're we're loyal to Arthur yes. cuz we this is Definitely. Arthur's all we've known. That's right. So, but I'm sure that when we play Red Dead 1 that we will yeah, you know, get a connection. Absolutely. To him. I like I do like John. I I of course Yeah, do like he's John. a cool guy. Yeah, he is. But um oh, and tell us what you think about his um, um, his clean shave. You guys like that? I think it looks very nice. Yeah, he does. Yeah, so. My favorite so far. I think he would have done that. <laughs> he did do that in the beginning. Did he? I think so, yeah. Oh, in the very beginning. That. I don't know. Cool. I could be wrong. Alrighty. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Dang, I gotta say John instead of author. You cussed already. Is that too soon? What did I say? Fuck three times. Oh, well. Nothing I can we'll do about it We'll see how it now. goes. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Wait, no. I, don't I usually say see you next time? <laughs> yes.